Hi, this is a Cubase quick tip on how to um, back up your projects for archiving. Or if you want to just like create a folder that contains your project, send it to someone for collaboration. Or um, yeah, so let's start. Um, one thing that you want to do um, before archiving, go media and prepare archive. Proceed. So um, this will basically copy any external files that weren't copied before into your project files. Sometimes it won't do anything. Sometimes it's going to copy stuff. So that's just one way of just making sure we're starting on the right foot. And then go File and go uh, Backup Project. Now um, here you want to create a folder. So I would... You can go, I'll do it on the desktop here, but you want to create a new folder for your backup. So I'll call this um, test backup, Cubase, select folder. Um, then you can give your project a name. I'll just give it the same name as this one and I'll, and I'll add backup. Um, you want to keep current project active. Uh, yeah, sure, for now, because my mic is routed into this project. Minimize audio files as if you want to save some space. Um, it will give you less handles on your audio files, but I suggest don't tick that. Um, make direct iPhone processing permanent, no. Um, remove unused files, uh, you could do that, but I just like to leave it like this and uh, do not backup video. So it keeps everything, every audio file, even if I'm not using them, it's going to copy them. So I'll go OK. And there you go. Your project is now backed up. If I go on my um, desktop, I have uh, my backup is uh, test backup Cubase. It's right here. So that's my project file. My audio files are here. My images are here. That's the tip.